Electronics has always been fascinating to me. It's the one thing that you, as a consumer, can see advance over time. I have a dad who's an electrical engineer, actually, so he builds robots for the Army. And all I kind of knew about what he did was that he made things work. I chose electrical engineering because I really loved math, always enjoyed problem solving, and was also interested in its applications. I've had two engineers in my family, two uncles, one electrical and one computer, so I've always been around technology. I switched into electrical engineering when I realized that a lot of the, the things that I was really interested in, in medicine and in neuroscience, they all have these engineering roots. They solve real world problems in all different kinds of domains. So they're electrical engineers working on spaceships, on roller coasters, on submarines. The next great piece of technology that I'd like to be involved in would be quantum computing or 3D printing. I mean, these are just things that are really blowing my mind. Like you can print something in 3D, like that's amazing. I'm graduating truly knowing computers from silicon to circuits to the code that runs on them. After graduation, I'll be taking my electrical engineering bachelor's and moving on to a robotics PhD at Carnegie Mellon. I'm hoping to study computer vision and human vision sort of at the same time. And I would probably want to go straight into the work field and try to find some companies that are focused on signal processing within electrical engineering. I want to build better computer vision systems that are inspired by human vision and see if we can figure out how the brain works. I've chosen to go on to get my PhD in computer science and specifically human-centered computing. And I'll be working with technology that has applications for stroke victims. It's cool because anything with electricity flowing through it would not work properly without you know, learning how to interpret the signals. So cell phones, medical equipment, calculators, sensors, anything with like embedded computer chips, pretty neat stuff. It's gonna help me in getting a job. It's gonna help me learning how to work with other people. Just the problem solving skills that I'm gonna learn here with engineering will help me in probably every aspect of life. Anyone who decides to go into this field and succeed will do so. You're going to do amazing stuff when you graduate. I think it's a no-brainer. You should come to Georgia Tech and be an electrical engineer.